Hello guys and welcome back to this channel. Where today guys, I'll be showing you how to add TSA PreCheck American Airlines. So guys, the first thing that you actually need to do is go to the App Store and download the American Airlines application. Now, when you did that, you just need to go and log into your profile. If guys, you didn't have one, you can always go and register to American Airlines. But guys, if you do not know how to do that, you can always go to our YouTube channel where you have plenty of how to American Airlines videos where you can see how you can do this. Now guys, that we got that out of the way, let's see what we actually have in front of us here. So as you can see, we have the American Airlines application where we have a lot of different options. First of all, we have the three main options, which are flight status, find a trip or book flights. You can also drag your bags, see the Wi-Fi and free entertainment, go to airport maps, Admiral's Club locations. You can of course log out. You can see the general information, privacy policy and contact the American. Also, in the top right corner, as you can see, we have the chat, the support chat, where you can go and talk to the support. So you can change your flight, check and help, upgrade your seats. But guys, if your problems are not here, you can always go to the type uh, to the chat box and type here and type the question that you have. Also, in the top right corner, we have the notifications, where we have notifications for your trips, offers, and news. So basically, all the notifications will be stored here. If they're not here, uh, sorry, uh, if they're um, not, and I don't have any at the moment, but be sure when you have them, they'll appear here. Now let's see how to add TSA PreCheck American Airlines. So to do, to do so, click on Manage tip, uh, Trip for each reservation. Then click on the Add Added Passenger Information to add your PreCheck number. You can also call American Airlines Customer Service to have them update your information. But the online self-service option is generally quicker. So guys, that is everything for this video. I hope that you found it informative. If you did, don't forget to like this video, share it, subscribe to the channel, put the notifications on, and I'll be seeing you in the next video. Bye, guys.